be more than you. Hello, 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 and welcome back to the channel, all my fellow more than humans. My name is Joseph Carroll. I write under the pen name J.R. Carroll, and today I have finally become a real booktuber. I have a lovely bookshelf behind me, which is not complete. Um, I, I have always had a bookshelf in my living room, a little bit bigger one than this. Um, but, you know, I've always wanted to get another one. I'm actually going to get a second one to put in here and kind of start building up the collection more. My wife wouldn't let me take all the goodies out of the one that's in the living room. Um, but I did get some of my favorites. Um, and I'll uh, show you guys a quick snippet of that here, here in a little bit. Uh, but yeah, it was uh, a perfectly executed uh, build. There was absolutely no issues whatsoever in building this thing. I wish I could show you guys how I did it. It's coming together nicely. I called for help twice and not a fuck you, what do you need, or nothing. All right, so <laughs> uh, besides all that goodness, um, all right, just a quick little tour of the bookshelf. Well, there's my uh, canvas here. But up top, we have my first novel, More Than a Vampire. Second novel, more than a gunslinger with my Harry Dresden mug that you guys may have seen. Then I actually have my Harry Dresden <laughs> Dresden files uh, hang out here. I have my McAnally's pub if you can see that. These are all autographed copies. My Blue Beetle replica that I've, my wife got me for my birthday. Then also a Christmas present from my f best friend, the Lash Hills Blackened Denarius. And that's just a random skull. At some point I will actually get a replica. And then again, I don't have these all, I don't have close to all my books down here, but I just started. Got uh, Michael Crichton's uh, last book here uh, that actually got written, Micro. Got American Psycho, Stephen King's Pet Cemetery, the book that was sent uh, to me from a f friend online. The Sword Defiant, one of the best covers I've ever seen. And then another book that was sent to me, I kind of uh, showed you, that's from Boo Ludlow. And then I got my mugs down here, my Jurassic Park mug. Then, uh, which I use, I use that all the time. And then we got my little uh, octopus squid mug, which is really hard to drink out of, so you don't see me use it very often. Then this is pretty much a just for show Snorlax uh, mug, but I had to have it. If you guys are early adopters of my channel, you will notice that mug I used to use in lives all the time back when I first started. Then down here, we got a uh, mug that looks like a camera lens but it actually screws off and it actually works relatively well my last place mug on the back end it says nailed it Harry Potter mug when it heats up it's got little footprints that go all the way around it and then you will notice from my profile picture my Jurassic Park mug that I got for Father's Day like three years ago um, this will fill out, and actually, if you guys send me a uh, a copy, you may find your book up here on the shelf too. But this will fill out and be better organized as we go on, and I actually will get another one of these to kind of fill out my office. Yeah, I just wanted to um, kind of give you an update of you know what I'm doing. Uh, I, I don't know why. But I just decided I was going to start reading um, Rage of Dragons. So I'll be finished with that tomorrow. And a 
So I'll have that out, I don't know, Sunday, Sunday morning. Um, but this Sunday night in prime time is going to be uh, me and Andrew from Andrew's Wizardly Reads. Uh, we're going to sit down and have a more than human conversation. Those are always a good time. Um, so I can't wait to just laugh and pick his brain. Um, you know, he may be the king of uh, reading here on BookTube. I think, uh, I'll find out exactly, but I think last year was like 210 books for him. I thought I had a lot at like 60 or 62, uh, but he makes me look like a chump. So I <laughs> uh, can't wait to see uh, Andrew. And some big news while we're here. Um, I thought that Expeditionary Force, which is my favorite sci-fi um, series of all time, closely followed by Red Rising, I thought it was over. Uh, it was supposed to be, uh, book 15 was supposed to be the last one. I think it came, Failure Mode came out in um, December. And then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, we got three more books, one every, de every December. So I'm just like... My mind is blown, so I can't wait to get more of that out to you guys. And I'm also working on a few more author interviews. Hopefully I can bring those to you here um, over the next month or two. But uh, thanks for all, for all of you uh, stopping in, checking out my awesome new uh, setup here. I don't know if this is going to be the final setup. We'll see how this video looks. Um, but uh, let me know in the comments, what are you guys up to over the next uh, week? What are you reading? And remember, be more than human.